kill him, he has a smaller cape called the, it starts with an M, whatever, Muleta, 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 the Muleta, mm. and, he, he, and he rises above the bull's head between the horns to drive the sword yeah. between the shoulder blades. With the heart. And, and, and kill, and kill, and the heart. The, 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 before that, the bandilleros come out and they dance around and they, and they go yeah. up and they go up and they try to stick the little things back there um, to torture and then well to, to, to loosen up that muscle then the, then the picadores come out on their old beat up horses that are all, and, they're they're and they want the bull to charge the horse right. and they're they're all cut the horses are now covered and they have these big giant leg protection things yeah. on a big yeah. metal stirrup and the, they let the bull charge the, the, pick up the, the, the horse, and the bull is trying to push the horse over, getting its horns underneath, exposing its muscle, right. and, the, and the picadors are ah. pushing that spear, and then leaning on it, with all, and maybe standing on it with all their might to sever the muscle as much as possible. To, yes. So that way the bull, when the matador at the end goes to kill, the bull mm. can't raise up his, oh, wow. raise up his yeah. head as much yeah, and, and, and put the matador at risk. So yeah. but the, the, the constantly they're watching to see, like I said, does, he, does the bull lead with a certain foot? Is one eye better than the other to cause it to move its head a different way? Or it's, is one horn slightly raised? Yeah. And if so, how does it impact the, the matador's trajectory to places? His